right, Julie, thanks very much. Tonight kicks off three straight nights of American Idol. The top eight compete for your votes tonight. And then tomorrow night, it's all competition that's set aside for Idol Gives Back. Idol contestants and celebrities are working hard already for that Wednesday night show. Some of them taped their performances earlier this week. Idol Gives Back is looking to surpass last year's total of $76 million raised for charities. Celebrities and musicians are also going to share clips of their recent pilgrimages to Africa. For many stars, being a part of Idol Gives Back was an easy choice. The second I was asked to do this, it was, it was a no-brainer for me. I mean, I watch the show every week. I watch American Idol, and, and I just know that, you know, they raised $76 million last year. I mean, that's such a huge impact for a two-hour show to be able to raise that much money. I mean, it's, it's a phenomenon to me. It's wonderful that people turn out in, in like they do. Um, all these major people that are, that are so busy and have so much stuff going on, getting together for one night to help people. And these people really do need help. Idol Gives Back tomorrow night at 7.30 right here on Fox 5. And there is a, a local connection to American Idol that a lot of you may not know about. We went to Springfield, Virginia to check it out. Take a look. And just stay here in this moment for When most of us watch the, the Idol auditions, we're looking to see the good, the bad, and the ugly. The folks at Nomadic Display are watching something else. Hardly anybody ever knows. They don't pay attention to this. They don't know what it is. I sit at home with my wife, and I watch this, and I go, honey, look how beautiful that display looks. We're not paying attention to the singers. We're like, look how beautiful the display is. Doesn't that look fabulous? If displays like the idle backdrop look familiar, it's because you've probably seen them before at trade shows. It is a small aluminum uh, system that folds, and literally in minutes, you can individually pop it up and build a back wall uh, for graphics to communicate your own company's message. The frame weighs just eight pounds, and as you can see, it's pretty easy to put up and take down. They've been nomadic displays bread and butter for more than 30 years, and that's the way it would have stayed for this small family-owned business in Springfield, Virginia, had Idol not come knocking. They had a need, and the need was something that they could take around from city to city, do auditions with that would be easy for their production team to set up, take down, take down, then transport to other cities and locations. Idol discovered Nomadic after season one. What they wanted was something that was about 20 feet wide, I mean about eight foot tall, uh, so they could use as their backdrops. They come back to us every year, same time August, and they give us basically two days to produce stuff. Um, and we produce it, produce the graphics, produce the hardware, send it out to their first location, um, and then they start filming. Workers at the plant in Springfield assemble the frames. The graphics department comes up with the display. What they give us is, is really just the graphics. It's just concept on a CD. Um, we supply, they supply that to me and my artist. My artists take it from there. They kind of doctor it up a little bit, lay the panels out, because when you look at the exhibit itself, it looks pretty continuous. But it's actually, the graphics are broken up into sections. This replica of the idol set sitting just inside Nomadic's showroom draws plenty of attention from visitors. Clients who come in here uh, don't know that we did it either, and so when they come in, they like to sit down, they like to have their picture taken in front of it so they can say they got in front of the American Idol booth. I have to admit, we were pretty tempted too. This is so cool. I love it. This is, this is probably as close, though, as I'm ever going to get to the real American Idol set. Hmm. wonder what it be, would be like to really sing for those judges. What made you audition for this competition? Oh, maybe not. Yeah, can't that carry a tune in a bucket. All right, Nomadic Display is now in talks with other shows that Simon Cowell is producing to do some projects for them. Again, it is a big week for Idol. The Elite Eight take the stage tonight at 8 o'clock to sing for your votes. And then Wednesday, Idol gives back at 7.30. The Idol's back to the competition on Thursday when one more singer gets the boot. That's well done.